Hey YouTubers, today I'm going to be sh showing you how to make and receive free phone calls from your iPod Touch. Second gen or first gen, it doesn't really matter. As long as you have a microphone, Apple iPod mic that fits the, um, uh, the iPod. I have these earphones with remote and mic. It's $30 from the Apple store. But it only works for the second gen. But there's another type of microphone that works for the first gen. So you could still do, do this on the first gen. So after you after you buy your earphones, and you uh, you must have Wi-Fi to make this work. So make sure you have Wi-Fi. And after that, um, go in to your iPod. Go to the App Store. Sorry, YouTubers, go to your app store. It's loading. And download a free application called Frank. It's from the app store. I've already installed it. Once you have it, it'll pop up like that. You'll have to make an account and stuff. And then after that, you'll see this keypad and stuff. After that, go on the internet and go to... You can go to any VIP, VIP, I mean, SIP place, but um, I use VoIPCheap.com. It has 20 minutes of free talking when you first sign up. You don't have to buy anything. So after that, after you download that, go through the instructions and install VoIPCheap. And then you should have VoIPCheap and be able to make free calls from your computer. After that, go into your iPod and go to more in Fring. Go to add-ons and go to SIP and then register your uh, SIP on your iPod. And after that, go back. You'll see that you'll make free call phone calls from your iPod Touch, but a drawback is that you won't be able to receive phone calls. It'll come as a private call and won't really like no one can call you back so it's like a one-way phone now to get your phone number go to a site called IP call and go to sign up I've already signed up so I won't be doing this um, I'll teach you how to do this though um, where they say choose the area code for IP call these are all um, I think Washington State phone numbers. Yeah, so uh, go first put your account type as SIP because you don't have a IAX account and then go to whatever area code you want. It doesn't really matter. I use 360 because it's easier to remember and then SIP phone number would be your username from your um, VoIP account and then the proxy would be in this case, it would be SIP for chief.com. And then email address, put your own email address. And then password, put your password from this account. I trust this account because it works. And after that, go type this stuff up the cap, the captcha, and then submit it. You'll get an email in like one hour. And then sign into your account. I won't be signing in because it shows your password. And that's not really good. Because people can log on to my account. And uh, once you have that done. They'll have a pa uh, they'll have a number up at the top. I won't be showing it. Because YouTubers will prank call me and stuff. It's happened before. So after that you should be able to receive phone calls. Straight to your iPod. Wait, let me type in my phone I password. Straight to your iPod Touch through Wi-Fi. But you must be connected to Wi-Fi to get these phone calls. The iPhones, um, it's even better for them because they have uh, 3G, so people they can get free phone calls from pretty much anywhere. And so that's how to get free phone calls to and from the iPod Touch.
Thank you, YouTubers. Subscribe, rate, and comment.